As the first round of summer rains reached its climax, torrential storms hammered large swaths of southern China, causing floods in towns and mudslides in rural regions. According to footage circulating on Chinese social media, streets turned into swollen rivers as automobiles and single-story residences were carried away in at least two counties in Guizhou province in southwestern China on Saturday. Rainfall has been the heaviest in some locations in 60 years. Five people were murdered in the neighboring autonomous province of Guangxi on Saturday when a home constructed of wood gave way after being pummeled by severe rains, according to official media. There were also reports of mudslides and road failures. According to state weather forecasts released on Sunday, heavy rain will continue in the provinces of Guizhou, Jiangxi, Anhui, and Zhejiang, as well as in Guangxi, until early next week, when a rainy window known as Dragon Boat Water peaks. Warm and humid air from the south collides with colder air masses from the north, resulting in unstable and wet weather across southern China in the weeks leading up to and following the Dragon Boat Festival in early June. According to local weather agencies, the early summer storms were more intense and lasted longer than typical this year, with precipitation in Guangxi, Guangdong, and Fujian reaching new highs since 1961. Cold and warm air have collided over southern China, resulting in a standstill and tug of war, said Wang Weiyu, an expert at weather.com.cn, a subsidiary of the China Meteorological Administration, 